all right today i'm building windows 11 into a full glass version of windows 12. every part of this system is getting redesigned the start menu is new with a clear glass and a soft blur the taskbar is fully glass and smooth the explorer gets a modern layout with rounded corners and a bright acrylic background icons look fresh and clean the folder has a new windows 12 star and the windows control are replaced with a smart button that only appears when you hover this is a complete transformation from start to finish. The goal is simple, make Windows feel like a raw next-gen OS. Before we start, quick reminder, only 8% of people who watch my video are subscribed. So if you enjoy clean Windows setups and advanced customization, hit the subscribe and also like this video so that you don't miss any future updates. Alright, before we get started, I've provided a zip file to some files you'll be needing in this customization. In the description below which you can download and also go ahead and download winhawk which we will also be using once downloaded just open the file app which will start this installation setup just click on install to install it on your computer and if you don't know winhawk winhawk is one of the most powerful tool when it comes to windows customization and if you really want to know more about it you can check the video on my channel. Alright, once the installation is done, just click on finish to start the Rainhawk application. And here, there are a bunch of mods we can install over here. But the first mod we are going to tackle is the Windows 11 Start Menu Styler. So just click on it and install. After the installation, head to Settings and here choose Translucent Start Menu and click on Save. So with this, we can see that our start menu has been changed to this beautiful glass one and this is beautiful if you don't have this beautiful new start menu i'm going to provide a blog in the description below for you to set it up for yourself now let's move to the taskbar to make the taskbar look modern with this windows 12 star we are going to open our Rainhawk app again and here install windows 11 taskbar styler head to settings and here choose windows glass at the bottom and click on save and look at this we have this beautiful taskbar and it goes with the start menu for this professional feel now if you don't want to put in effort to change your volume over here then you can install taskbar volume control which will help you to scroll on your taskbar to increase or decrease your volume and this is really beautiful to get the nice download speed on our taskbar you have to install a mod called taskbar clock customization right to settings and scroll down once here we are going to remove the date over here and just paste in this code which is percentage download underscore speed percentage and with this if i save you are going to see we have this beautiful download speed over here with the time you can remove the seconds at the top here and click on save to give it a more minimal and beautiful look if you want to take your taskbar to the next level you can install taskbar auto hide when maximized to make your taskbar very smart and automatically hide when you move your window closer to the taskbar or when you maximize any window and i think this is one of the pretty cool mods you can can install here now to make your quick settings look more nicer with your notification panel we are going to install a mod called windows 11 notification center styler which will really elevate the windows quick settings and the notification panel and to get that head to settings and here click on the none and choose windows glass alternative which i really find it to be very professional and also looks more there now let's see how we can make our windows control smarter with an auto hide effect to gives our windows a cleaner look to get that install another mode called us team hook on winhawk and extract the zip file i've included in the description below and right click on it and copy once you have it head to your local dixie and paste it over here once you have it here just open it up and you are going to see these two folders inside open the smart window controls select everything over here copy and now head to your local dixie again go to windows and here look for resources open teams and paste it over here click on continue to paste it once you have it here you can just close your folder app and open your window settings go to personalization click on teams and here 
choose this version which is the windows 12 dark and with this we can close it up and when i open any folder you are going to see my icons is now hidden and it only shows when i hover on it and this is the most professional way on how windows 12 should have looked now i'll open wrinkles and change my wallpaper back to the default one i'm using again and now let's see how we can get the new windows 12 icons on our computer to get it we are going to use a tool inside rainhall called resource redirect and here i'll just click on it and install once the installation is ongoing i'll open my file explorer again head to the local dc open the windows 12 folder and here you are going to see windows 12 icons just open it up and copy the path head back to rainhawk go to settings and here paste the path here and click on save settings and with this we are going to see our icons will be changed to these new icons and it's pretty cool if yours is not showing you can just right click on your start menu click on task manager and here select windows explorer and restart and once done you are going to see these beautiful new icons which is the windows 12 style icons and this is beautiful the next thing we are going to do is to give our windows folders a nice modern look by removing the other half which covers everything inside our folder and to do that we are going to search for folder thumbnail fix on google and here we are going to click on the github link over here and just click on the release session and click on download to download the zip file once you have it you can open it up and you are going to see these files inside what I recommend you do is to open your local DC and here head to the Windows 12 and create a new folder here to contain that file. So I'll just create the folder and just drag everything over here. Once you have it here, you can just double click on the folder thumbnail fix.tse and here you can choose between the default version or the more professional one. So I'll just click on this to set it up, which will restart our explorer. And now if I open any folder, you are going to see this new folder thumbnail and this is the best I think. So let's see how we can transfer our file explorer to get that modern file explorer of Windows 12. And to get that, we are going to search for explorer blame maker click on the first github link which will take you to their repository and click on the release once here scroll down and click on the release s64.zip file and click on open file once you have it open just head to your local dc folder again which is the windows 12 and just drag everything over here once you have it open it up and right click on the register.cmd and run as administrator which is going to restart your explorer and with that we are going to see this beautiful glassy explorer and it looks good but there's some few things we can do let's open the release folder again and here right click the config.ini and open with notepad once here change the a200 to 30 and also the 120 to 20 save it up and close once done just right click on the register again and run as administrator and now we can see our explorer is looking more nicer and the blur is looking more cleaner now let's make our top session look modern to make our top session look modern we can open rainhawk app and look for windows 11 file explorer styler and install once installed head to settings and here choose minimal explorer 11 and click on save settings and with this when we open our explorer we are going to see this new session at the top and this look more cleaner and beautiful with this hidden hover effect and this is beautiful and now there's one issue with explorer and that is the file sizes are in kilobytes and you don't get to understand it very well and we can fix it with a mod called better file size in explorer so just click on it and install and now we can see the actual sizes in megabytes and some in gigabytes and i think this is the best way on how the explorer sizes should look our windows right click contest menu look great but we can replace it with a more professional advanced one which is called shell and we can get it by just typing shell contest menu on google and here click on the 
no soft shell scroll down and here click on download now scroll down a bit and you are going to get the download setup 64 just click on it to download it on your computer once done just open it up click on next and install on your computer once installed just click on finish and we are going to see this beautiful contest menu and it comes with a whole lot of features and this is by far the best contest menu you can find on windows now if you have this issue where if you open any window on top of the other the nice blade effect gets hidden and you don't see it at the background then you can fix it with maker for everyone which you can just download on their github page and with this we can just open it up and install on our desktop and once done just click on your tray icon here and click on this maker for everyone icon which will open this window just click on global and here scroll down and here make sure you toggle extend frame into client area and also enable blur behind to make it look professional so with this if i open multiple windows i'm still going to see this beautiful blur effect at the background and this is beautiful the full windows 12 glass os build this is the cleanest and the most complete version of windows i've ever made if you find this video helpful remember to subscribe and like this video to help me make more advanced and detailed videos like this for you guys see you in my next one